<laughs> and are you, you're now a practicing Buddhist? Correct. I've been practicing Buddhism for 14 years now. Wow. Um, and I chant every morning and evening. Well, usually every day I chant for sure up to an hour. Right now I'm chanting two hours a day. Wow. Um, All Nam Yoko Renge Kyo. It's, it's Nam Yoho Renge Kyo. Oh, thank you. Nam Yoho Renge, Renge Kyo. Kyo. And it means dedication to the law of cause and effect simultaneously through sound or vibration. Mm. And when you're chanting, they use the lotus suit, the lotus flower sort of as a symbol because the lotus blooms and flowers at the same, you know, flowers and seeds at the same time. Okay. So like, and it grows in the murkiest of waters and yeah. the dirtier the water, the pretty, you know, the flower. So when you really start chanting, you're stirring up these things and these obstacles in your life. But it's how you break through your obstacles and what you do when you create your human revolution. And we, I practice with the SGI, Soka Gakkai International SGI. And um, it's, it's a lay organization, and it's for world peace. So, mm -hmm. you know, and when I came out here to school, I wanted to look for, like, um, you know, pursue my career, which was fashion at the time, and then religion. I wanted faith in my life. So I went to Baptist church. It was all very kind of Tina Turner oriented. But I just liked. <laughs> I, love, I, I, did, I, went to the, I just love your Tina Turner inspiration. <laughs> oh, the, pa the panties in case you got beat down, silent. And <laughs> if you uh, the just the performances as a kid, and then the the turn to Buddhism. Like Tina Turner's really paved the Tammy Brown Road. You know, I learned uh, like how to to really model and stuff, and smile and be more charismatic because of Tina Turner and if you wow. look at her pictures the faces and things you know <laughs> yes. I learned I learned all that because of her and her Brits and different photographers and things like that because of Tina Turner and she has a very simple style mm. and this outgoing energy and the best wigs and yes. everything and legs and everything do you remember when Oprah was wearing that Tina Turner wig for I a whole year? I liked the wig. In fact, I, I made my own Tina Turner wig, but Did I you? liked that wig, and I think shame on St Stedman for telling her to take it off. I know. <laughs> do you still do Tina numbers like every once in a while? Yeah, yeah. I do. I, pe that's something people really like is when I do my Tina Turner numbers, you yes. know? Yeah, because you got that rock and roll spirit in you since you were a kid. You better believe rock and roll beauty queen. Yes. <laughs> Queen.